Hey guys, welcome to this video on NVIDIA. NVIDIA today down 10% in one day. This, this made me very compelled to make this video. What is this doing? This is now the second lower high. Unless this is some kind of bullish flag and the whole market's going to go higher, we have to respect that this market could be putting in some kind of a top. And that implies that we might be seeing a lot of profit taking going forward. Let me show you the other reasons why this wouldn't surprise me. If we look at price to sales, price to sales over long term is very high in the 50s. Some of the highest numbers for NVIDIA, the low numbers on price to sales for NVIDIA are 16 and 8. So that's where NVIDIA has bottomed. Maybe it doesn't go all the way down to 16. Maybe it stays high. But 50, 40, and 50, 25. Those have been high valuations on a price-to-sales basis. Let's look at another metric, something like, let's say, here we go, we have cash flow. On a price-to-cash flow, very high lows have been 38 it's at 55 that's not too bad uh, it has bottomed at 20 and 38 before so that's not too bad let's jump over to some headlines uh, there's been a I've been looking at the news there's been a mix of negative headlines uh, this one i just saw not too long ago nvidia gets doj subpoena in escalating antitrust probe and here's another one showing the same thing. So could this be one of the major triggers? Another anti-monopoly case. The other one we heard about was Google, Apple before that. Are they getting criticized for anti-monopoly behavior? They're saying they're seeking evidence that the chip maker violated antitrust laws. Could that be the trigger? Jumping over to my valuation worksheet, I have in NVIDIA right here. They're at this current price that they're at, 2.5 earnings yield, which is less than the S&P. And for next year, forward 2025, 3% earnings yield. Uh, what would a fair value be for this stock over the next five years? 182 and as high as 258 in five years. And that's just taking into account the earnings and earnings growth. The earnings growth over the next five years is only about 18% according to analysts. So that's not great after such a big run. Remember, this was a $12 stock. It went up as high as over 120. Right now it's at 108 with a low yield and bad news coming in to the woodwork. So back to the stock chart, if we look, NVIDIA, since the lows, when uh, there was a lot of bad news in 2022, it was up over 11, it looks like 11 times. So would a 50% pullback into the 80s, is that in the cards? What's an extension of high too low 50% could this be a $50 stock now I've seen that pattern before other traders know what that looks like there's going to be some support that will be tested potentially if that 100 level 90 to 100 level gets tested and it breaks it would be not surprising for the stock to go to 50 now what is the reason? We don't know the reason. All we know is a lot of people, there's been a lot of enthusiasm in Netflix. Would, would this shake out a lot of investors? Would this cause people to force? Is there enough liquidity? Another interesting fact, today the volatility index shot up. It went up to 20, 37%. So that is not a good sign. If we look at the NASDAQ, the NASDAQ was down 3.15%. The S&P 
the semiconductor index 7.7 .7 down. So same thing. We've got support that may be tested. NVIDIA is a big part. Is it time for profit taking? Is that what we're seeing? So I don't know the answer, but this is just what I am seeing right now. It looks like there is selling in a big way in NVIDIA. So don't be surprised. If, if you can't handle the heat of the stock going down, then place a stop loss. Reduce your risk, and you know maybe this is good news to you. Uh, my analysis says this could be a 200 to 250 dollar stock in the future. So if it goes to 50 dollars, hey, that may, may not be a bad thing. Seeing a cheaper stock and holding it for the long term. Uh, let me know if you agree or disagree. And is this all hocus pocus? Is technical analysis astrology? Is this just going to be a short term dip in the stock? What do you think?